integrated writing task. This task gives you the opportunity to demonstrate your ability to show that you can communicate in writing about academic information you have read and listened to. You will read a passage about an academic topic for three minutes, and then you will hear a short lecture related to the topic. Then you will be asked to summarize the points in the listening passage and explain how they relate to specific points in the reading passage. You will now see a text scrolling up on the screen. You may also find this text in the description box of this video. In order to make this task more challenging than the official TOEFL, you will be giving 90 seconds to read the reading portion of this task. In the official TOEFL, you will be given three minutes to read the entire text. Now get ready to start reading. Graded school system. Now listen to a lecture on the same topic as the passage you have just read. So, what are the problems associated with the graded school system? Well, for one thing, graded schools don't take into account the, the differences in academic readiness on the part of individual learners. And by that, I mean that some six-year-olds are simply not socially, mentally, or even physically mature enough to begin school but others are ready in all those important ways by their fifth or even fourth birthdays. And uh, by the time that girls and boys are in their early teens, we can see that there's a significant difference in maturity, in, in physical and social maturity, but they're still grouped together in intermediate grades in a graded school system. Okay, besides the obvious differences in individual readiness and maturity, the, the whole issue of promotion needs to be reviewed. Grade-level requirements don't really deal with the actual learning that has occurred uh, in a positive way. Many research studies confirm that repeating an entire year because some of the material is not learned contributes to, to boredom, poor self-concept, and, and eventually to higher dropout rates. And since graded schools are using group expectations as measured by performance on standardized tests, this is another way to evaluate the group rather than the individual. So what happens is that individual differences in how long it takes to learn a concept or, or the partial achievement of a grade-level curriculum that is never addressed by the graded school system. Students who need more time to learn have to repeat material that they already know. Students who can learn at a faster rate have to wait for the new material to be presented. So as you can see, it's not ideal. Now get ready to answer the question. You will have 20 minutes to plan and write your response. In the description box of this video, you will find a 20-minute timer that you can use to time your response. Typically, an effective response will be 150 to 225 words. Essay question. Summarize the main points in the lecture, explaining how they cast doubt on the ideas provided in the reading passage.
Do you need someone to evaluate your response once you are done writing it? Send us an email and we'll gladly take a look at your response. You could find our contact info in the description box below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching our video. And remember, score well, go anywhere.